Hello, white belts. I'm going to teach you what you need to learn to go for your yellow belt. So starting off with the stances that we need to learn. The first one is the tension stance, where our feet are together, hands in a fist by our side, standing up nice and straight, and our shoulders back. This is called a tension stance. So you might hear me at the start of training say, Chariet, which is Korean for attention. And this is when we stand with our hands by our side and nice and straight. The next one is ready stance. So from here, we use our breathing and our hands open to come up. We breathe in, close our fist and breathe out in a short, sharp action. And our hands come nice and strong. And you'll notice my feet are now shoulder width apart. So there's a little space between our feet. Both the feet are pointing forwards and my hands are in the fist and I'm still standing up nice and strong. So again, from tension stance, my hands come open, I breathe in, close, and breathe out. And this is called ready stance. The next stance we're gonna do is horse riding stance. And like the name, it's like we're sitting on a horse. So our feet are apart, a bit wider than ready stance, both my feet are pointing forwards, and now I'm bending my knees like I'm sitting on a horse. And my hands are in a fist on my hips. In this stance, we can do our punches and we can do our blocks, all from horse riding stance. And the last one is fighting stance. This is when we're doing sparring. Feet are apart, hands are up, and we're in good stance so we can bounce and we can do our kicks and our strikes. So if I'm on the side, you'll see there's a good distance between my feet. Both legs are bent, I have good balance, and my hands are up and I'm looking forward so I can bounce from here. Again, from here, I'm looking forward and my hands are up and I'm ready to fight. The next stuff we're gonna go through are some kicks. So these are all from fighting stands. The first kick we're gonna do is front kick. So front kick, we're kicking straight up and we're lifting our knee first. We're pointing our toes and we kick forward and back. We're trying to kick with the ball of our foot here, yeah, not with our toes. So hands up, knee up, flick and come back. Again, on the side, I come up, flick and back. Front kick. And the next kick we're going to do is called roundhouse kick. This is when we kick on the side. So we're going to use our instep now in fighting stance. As we come up, as we bring our knee up, our supporting leg, our foot that's on the ground, is going to pivot around to the side. So come up, pivot, flick, and back. And on the side, watch my supporting leg, it pivots, and I come back. This is roundhouse kick. And the last kick is axe kick. This is a high kick. We're keeping our legs straight, and we're gonna hit with our heel. So from fighting stance, I come straight up, straight down, and land forward with our straight leg. Up and down. Up and down. Up and land forward. And that's axe kick. And they're the three kicks that you need to learn to go for your yellow belt. The next, we're going to do our two strikes. So we're going to start in horse riding stands with our hands on our hips in a fist. And the first one is body punch. So in a strong fist, we're going to punch body height right in front of our in front of our body with our other hand on our hip and we're going to aim with our two front knuckles here so that's where we're punching and as we come out for the next punch this hand turns comes back to my hip so same time as i punch this hand is on my hip so come out nice and strong this is body punch so punching body height and then the next one, we're gonna do head punch. So punch into the face now. As we come up, 
We're looking over our knuckles so we know that it's face height. And you can see my punching hand as it comes back, it's coming to my hip as I change hands. And they're the two punches, body punch and face punch that we need to learn. Now we're going to go into our blocks. So the first one, again we're going to do our blocks from horse riding stance. We're going to do low block. So we're blocking in front of our body, nice and low. So our blocking arm is going to come up to our shoulder. Other arm is going to be out straight. We're going to slide down our arm as this arm comes back to my hip. So it comes down, goes to my hip and I block in front of my body. My other hand, arm comes up, slide down, and block. Up, down, and we're blocking with our forearm in front of our body. Up, down, and we're changing arms nice and quick. And we're stopping strong in front of our body. Up, down, up, down. Up, down. Good. And then the next one is body block. So we're protecting in front of our body here. So we're going to come up. And this arm's going to be in front of our body. And as we turn, we're blocking with this arm with our forearm in front of our body. And this arm here comes to my hip again. So here, to my hip, and I'm coming across my body. Up. Turn, and to my hip. And we're stopping nice and strong across our body. And that's body block. And the last one we're going to learn is head block. This time, we're going to start with one arm in front of our body. Our blocking arm is going to come across, like a cross. We're going to come up. So it goes past our face and stops right on front of my head, blocking with my forearm. And this arm to my hip. So this comes down, cross, and up. Down, cross, up. Down, cross, and up. Down, across, up. And back to our attention stance. So, there are all the stances, the kicks, the blocks, and the strikes that you need to learn to go for your yellow belt. So, make sure you practice them at home and if you look at the syllabus sheet, next to the, each block or strike, it's got the same word in Korean. You'll need to learn all the Korean language for our top and no strikes and kicks and stances. Um, and good luck, practice hard, and good luck for your gravies.